Hello, one and all, welcome back to Let's Play Nox. I'm one of the tacos. When we last left off, we were here in the heart. Probably about to do a really hard fight. The heart of Nox. Now, how do we get to it? That is the question. Can't open this box. But I think I have a sneaking suspicion of what I can do with it. I believe this is a basic puzzle. Yes. That would appear to be the case. Alright. Can move these ones too. This is not going to make me any new friends. You have retrieved the heart of Nox. Uh -oh. The third component of the Staff of Oblivion is the Weirdling Beast, which is found within the Temple of Ix. Go there, lad. Find the Weirdling, but bring it back with the greatest care. Only the halberd you have can carry it, since its touch destroys all other metals. Powered with the heart of Nox's fountainhead of magical energy, the Weirdling Beast's bottomless appetite for pure power is kept well fed. Together, they create a supreme weapon against the evil Queen's minions. This is as close as I can bring you. The Temple of Ix lies north of the village. You must make your way quickly, but you may need the help of Alwyn to get there. Retrieve the Weirdling Beast and meet me back here in this clearing. Move smartly, lad! So... It apparently changed my weapon. Probably made it better, I imagine. 58, level 4 shock now. Ooh. Sweet. So what's this way? Something over there, obviously. Oh, we get in this way. Sweet. Some minor gold. 26 gold. Sorry if the microphone settings aren't quite right. Or the, the headset settings. Uh, the volume settings, I should be meaning to say. Be feel a little quiet to me, but it might just be my ears. Something doesn't feel right. It feels like I'm not recording, but I should be. Everything should be set. So the Village of X, what do you all have to say? Best of luck on your quest, young adventurer. They don't hate me like everyone else seems to hate me. A general store? We will now start comparing Welcome. prices. You here, aren't you? Your money is still good with me. Okay. So scroll all the way back up to repair my chest. You want twenty four forty three. So we'll find the cheapest person here. Twenty four forty three. Remember that everyone. Ooh. Shocky. Apples, which I think I do need. Must be pretty neat having an apple tree in your backyard. Could smash that open. For shurikens. Apple. Nothing in there. There's no wonder people don't like me. All I do is come onto people's property and break things. Ooh, cure poison. Don't need that. I need potions of regular healing, though, if I could find any. Just gold. Can't argue with gold. Free money. And that was someone's entire year saving that I just took. 42 gold. Two years of saving. Sorry, person. My needs are many. Well, it must have been your gold I stole. I went in this one already. Didn't go in here. Jailer? Wanna see the inside of a cell? No. Hello. Can't talk to you. Well, tell me right there. Yeah, the jail. You don't want to talk. Locked by a mechanism. This is magic shop. Do you repair things? Hmm. It would appear the weighty responsibility of wielding the Staff of Oblivion has been handed out on a first-come, first-served basis. 
It certainly doesn't seem that it has anything to do with who is fit or qualified. If it did, the staff would be in the hands of one following the wizard's way. Ooh, you want to back that up? Also, you're cheaper than the other guy. Noted. I think that was 1953. I forget already. The magical well. Hooray, it will heal us. But we do not need services at this moment in time. This person sells wolves. Hail, traveler. Can I interest you in a charmed beast to accompany you on your quest? Please no. And that way leads out of the town. Hey, haven't I been here before? This village is... Yes, I have been here. I knew this village started to seem familiar. I will take your pants. I cannot loot your pants. Congratulations, you're safe for now. Tavern! You don't repair things, if I recall. Ah, yes. Well, These you do. Times, leaving chaos in its wake and black Too much. On a stormy horizon. Nope. We're only checking repair costs at this moment. We will check sell prices afterwards. But presumably, the guy who will repair it for the cheapest is this guy who will buy it for the most. We will have to test. We'll find out who's the best merchants here in this town. At this moment in time. I say that because it might have... Ch We've been here before, but it could have easily changed since then. Eh. 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 Can't get in there. Ooh, meat. I love barrel meat. There is a mysterious sorceress, Hecuba, roaming the southern lands. She's said to be in possession of a magical object of great power. Interesting. Alright, this is a general store, so there's not really any good stories here. There's really only the general store, the wizard store, and the uh, tavern. There's no armor smith or anything. So... Mm. It would appear the weighty responsibility of wielding the Staff of Oblivion has been handed out on a first-come, first-served basis. It certainly doesn't seem that it has anything to do with who is fit or qualified. If it did, the Staff would be in the hands of one following the wizard's way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep talking, old man. That everything? My helmet doesn't need repairing? Huh. Fair enough. Okay. So now you want to sell things. So you'll buy this first sapphire for 263. We're going to go check the other two merchants now. I realize this might take a while, but it is something we have to do. You know, too many disheartening reports have passed through here in the last few days. With no good news, the tombs of Valor have been desecrated. Kadav. Also, that person looks like a f able warrior. I've heard strange <coughs> and disturbing stories about the land of the dead. Something about walking skeletons. I don't know who spreads these insane rumors. I've dealt with skeletons myself, so they're not quite as insane as you might believe. Didn't mean to charge there, but it's not like it really hurt. I mean, other than the fact that it physically hurt, but we'll get over that. Okay. So, Please the other sell. guy was 263 for the best price. So, armor. sell... This is the place. 280. So, you, bu you buy for the most right now. Also, there's nothing behind your store. Welcome. So, we're going to do the selling to you. The money is still good with me. Basically, everything. Because most of the stuff is wizard stuff anyways. So, essentially, we're selling everything to you. Let's start up here. I was right in my theory that those staves would sell for a decent bit. They don't sell us for as much as I might have hoped. But they sell more than slippers. And more than the helmets, too. Of course, quantity matters. Like how many charges they have left. Of course. As you would imagine. Just sell all this wizard stuff. Then from there we can determine what we want to keep among our items. 
Right now I'm just potting off wizard stuff. And making a pretty penny from it too. <sighs> oh, that is the big ol' hammer, yeah. Don't want to sell that yet. We want to do some looking. If we're going to fight undead. That probably means zombies again. Which means we're going to want to keep our fire sword longer. Instead of getting rid of it. This one should sell for a lot. Yeah, 300. Okay. So. Let's do some comparing. Also, let's put our important armor back on. We don't need that. Steady bronze plate of the dragon's claw when we're wearing the mighty silver plate of anti-zap. So New we're gonna area. sell that because it's Your just still good with me. we're trading fire for lightning but the, the the armor value is just straight up better. Okay comparing these two items we've got Total damage 46, we've got total damage 109. It caught, it's a lot, hits a lot harder. All this has is vampirism. I think we're gonna get rid of it. Your gold is always welcome here. It's your gold you're giving to me, buddy. See, he wanted 800 for that. I think, apparently, this one was a little less valuable to him. Also, it probably needs repairing. Yes. Might as well have it ready and repaired on hand if we're gonna keep it around. Go back to selling. We don't need this extra helmet. And we don't need this breastplate. We're already determined that we're going to keep the one we have now. Now we have here. Wasp Bane. Iron Zap and Dragon's Claw. So we have one of each of those elements. Frankly, it's probably not a good idea to be hauling those around. But I'm going to continue to do it anyways. I don't think we actually need to be carrying around these mushrooms. Because we have the potions to cure poison, it's not like we use them and the mushrooms don't heal for that much. And they have a negative side effect to them anyways. Might be a mistake. I think everything else we want to keep. This is a good offhander. And we're keeping this strictly for the fire damage. For the fire type. Alright. I think the last save was right here, yeah. Because the most recent one down there is at the bomb, so we start at the top. Couldn't have planned it better. Now equipped in mighty armor. Let's take one more look around in here just in case. No, nope, don't want to let me in, buddy. This is the home of Mayor Theogrip. I know, I've seen him before. Be blessed. Alright, where exactly are we going? Don't remember. What is the thing here that I don't know what that does? And this was towards the orc camps, I do believe. I believe this is where we were fighting all those orcs. And there was that area that I never did learn how to get into, but I should be able to just snag that gold, yep. Had to figure out a way in there at some point. Sweet. Money. Temple of Ix. Cemetery. We've been here. We can't go that way because we no longer have the keys for it. We've been in here as well, but I imagine this place has repopulated its loot. Let's repopulate its people. Greetings. I am Aldwin, the master conjurer for the village of Ix. The staff is now prepared to convey the weirdling beast. The beast is housed in the Temple of Ix, guarded by the sacred order of Oblivion. You must go to the temple and speak to the priests. Here is the key to unlock the gate which blocks passage to the temple. Thank you. Ah, you didn't hide that chest. Mine! Next to the potion! That you didn't offer. Alright. Oh no. Dead. That was a devastatingly powerful foe. I hope not to encounter any more of those, lest I might be destroyed. Nothing out there that I can see with my eyes. Also, wow, it is dark in here. 
I've completely, I'm, give me a minute, I'm sorry. Completely messed with my eyesight, I completely gone blurry there for a second. Oh shoot. I missed my charge, but the good news is I killed the bear anyways. What secrets did the bear hold? Another bear! Live through my charge! Congratulations, that's not something many people can brag about. Steady armored boots? Don't know if those are any good compared to what I have, but I will eat all this delicious meat. Thank you for the meat. Alright, so now let me go check those boots real quick, because my boots aren't magical, so these might just be better. Armor value 83, 94. No, sir! But I bet these are usable by conjurers. Yep, yep. So if I were a conjurer, that'd be an upgrade. No doubt about that. But I'm not a conjurer. So... Come through. Dead. The bear had lots of pre-cut meat with him. And no more cave. And that's not I can loot. Give me the money. Where to go? Don't hide the money from me. I know you dropped money. Where'd you hide it, stump? Give me your money. There it is. Found it. 55 gold. Oh no. Dead. Another bridge. Why oh, wonder? No, can't go that way. Well, that must be the temple. And that's an enemy wolf. Who would soon be dead. Who is now dead. That's for wizards. And probably conjurers too. And that's another cave. And that's a wolf. Get back here. I'm not wasn't done with you. Dead wolves. Meat. And a chest. What's in the chest? Gold! Do I need the meat? Yes, I do. Probably should have picked up the meat in the bear cave too, but I thought I was full. <clears throat> Pardon me. Can I help you? We you looking for a fight? Your arrival. The sacred order of oblivion are the caretakers and devout guardians of the weirdling. Once you reach the weirdling, the beast will cling to the staff. Since the heart of Nox contains the richest source of energy it requires, much more than the meager offerings in the pools. Okay. The weirdling thrives on pure energy, which it receives from the Zon pools in the remote depths of our subterranean temple. Okay. With the energy provided by the staff, the weirdling beast can channel the very forces of life itself. It is a weapon without peer, and will even channel a bit of your adversary's life into your own. Sweet, gives me life, Leech. It is time to resume your quest, lad. Hecuba grows more powerful with each passing minute. Okay. You're a cool guy. I like you. Can we talk more? It is time to resume your quest, yeah. lad. Bah! Let's go! I hear frog beasts. Oh, oh! This is wonderful. That's got close behind me. Yes, quite. Do 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 do. Hello, spiders! Did I fall down a hole? Oh. Nope, thought that might be destroyable. Can't. Ooh, I can! Ha ha! Oh. There's another one! Let's try that again! <laughs> Gabe's like, fool you! Let's try that again! I have a feeling I should like clear this area first. Originally I thought this way might be some kind of secret, but 
Now I'm thinking you actually have to go this way, like, legitimately. Aha! One more hole, huh? Sweet. So now we're done down there. So I'm going to come back down here and finish killing off these spiders. Because I am a man. Oh, no! I'm not that much of a man. No, oh, I won't hit it. Fair enough. I used to one hitting those things. I'm used to them kicking my arse. All right. When we come back, we will continue exploring the Temple of X. Thank you all for watching. This is Wamataku signing off. Take care and bye bye. <laughs>